Maserati just debuted an electric drop top one-off that celebrates wine. This is the Maserati Grand Cabello Fogery Tinguello. What's good guys? Welcome back to Ron's Rise. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where anyone who loves Italian wine, well, they're going to know Marquis Tito and Tioni family. Now with that said, they boast a family of winemaking history of over 600 years passed down through 26 generations. So to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the Tignanello, one of the most renowned red wines, Maserati has created a customized version of their latest creation, the Grand Cabrio Fogre. Now the exclusive one-off will go up for auction on July 14th, which is about two weeks from today in California at the Napa Valley Festival. Here in the United States, that's one of America's most important arts and education charity events. Now, before looking and getting into the special Grand Cabrio Fogliari up close, you'll need to know what the Tinirello is. The first vintage is quite young at 1971 and comes from 76,682 vines of an ancient Chianche vineyard called the Tinirello, located 390 meters above sea level on a hilly terrain rich in Abereste Ingresso. Now, the wine is made from a selection of Santrovisi and Cabernet from the vineyard of the same name located at Tintinuti Tiniello in the heart of Chianti Classico on a 57 hectare plot of land facing southwest. On the 110th anniversary of the Trident, Maserati pairs its name with that of this wine and draws inspiration from the vineyard, a metaphor for roots and territory. Now, the Grand Cabrio Fogre Tintinello is therefore immediately recognized by its Terra de Tintinero paint, a chestnut color inspired by the soil of the vineyard, worn by a coppery burgundy that recalls the central red shades of the characteristic Tintinero barracks. Now, wheels and calipers are in matte black and glossy black, respectively, while the emblems are in copper color and the fabric soft top is black. Now, on board the Tintinero, well, it has leather seats embellished with multi material cannelloni in silver and burgundy made of Vigia, a technical fabric never used before on a car that has the geometries of rows of the Tintinero hill. Now, characterized from the Aberese rocks in the center row. Now, to recall the high impression of the oak barrels, the dark brida with a laser etching was chosen, which embellishes the panels where you can even read how the Tinirero was born. Now, on a headrest, an elegant embroidery combines the Maserati Trident with one of the Tinirero's distinctive features, the sun, which has always stood out on the bottle label. The same symbol is found lasered on the central tunnel together with the dates 1971 and 2021. These refer to the first and current vintage of the Tinirero 50 years after the presentation of this wine on the market. With that said, this very special edition one-off Maserati Grand Cabrio Fogari, which is the Gran Turismo but with the convertible roof and fully electric, well, this stands out. This is what Maserati is all about. Special fine luxuries like this one here. I love this spec. I think my favorite thing though is going to be that interior, especially the Trident etching. Something new, something flavorful, something very rich in history. But I want to know what do you guys think? Besides the fact that, yes, it's an electric Maserati we're still trying to get used to, but what do you guys think about the special edition, the spec, and the reasoning behind everything they did here? Drop those comments down below. Now, if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, but check out the links in the description if you want to help further support the channel. I appreciate the love. You guys can also subscribe, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And with that said, we will see you guys in the next one. Peace.